We're hearing now from Reuters that 50 people are dead following soccer riots in Egypt. Uh, we're going to join Mohamed uh, Fahmy. He joins us on the line from Cairo. What more can you tell us? What on earth has happened? Well, it's, uh, it's a breaking news and the fact that two soccer matches going on today between Al Ahli, which is a leading uh, football team, and Port Said, with, uh, in Port Said Stadium. What we're seeing is an unprecedented situation where thousands of fans just stormed onto the field and there has been clashes between the two sides. Uh, we spoke to the Ministry of Health and we know that in Port Said and Ahli, there's 25 people who have died and hundreds injured, and uh, the injuries are caused of concussions and deep cuts, and uh, it seems that the situation is unfolding. This is the information we have so far. At the same time, there is also another situation in Cairo Stadium between al Zamali Club and Ismailia, where there's a huge fire as we speak now, and it seems that more people have died. The, the total of these is t so far is 50, according to the health ministry. Max? Uh, in terms of the two separate matches, so you're saying that one stadium's on fire, but the pictures we're looking at now are at a different match, Port Said, uh, early pictures of everyone getting on the, on the pitch, but obviously then it turned to riots, yeah? Yes, what we're hearing, and it's not confirmed yet, is that the crowd, the gate that's separating the crowds from the stadium was somehow opened, or maybe it has been, the, because there's so many fans that have stormed into, onto the field, and yes, what we're looking at is Port Said and Ahli. There is presence of police, but it seems that there was not uh, as much interference from the police. Of course, we know now on the political scene happening in Cairo, there has been a sort of a security vacuum lately with several armed robberies happening in the past two days. And the situation is uh, a shocking the situation to the public to see two soccer matches at the same time, it's, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's a situation that's unfolding as we speak, Max. A security official apparently told the Associated Press um, uh, that the home team, Al Masri, swarmed the field after they won, 3-1. It's a very rare win, so it seems as though it started off as excitement and turned into something else. Well, sir, we are not very clear if... They, they stormed in uh, uh, due to excitement, but what we know so far is that, yes, the team did win 3-1, the home team at Port Said, and uh, the situation is unfolding as we see uh, how it happened. Uh, we're trying to find out from the Minister of Interior what the situation, what, what started all this. That's the question. We are trying to get to see where this is going uh, at the moment, but it's also very uh, suspicious that at the same time there's also another situation unfolding in Cairo in another soccer game where where the clashes are ongoing right now. Yeah, tell us what you can about that. How many injured or killed or what figures have you got on that one? The Cairo match, not the match that we're watching on TV right now. Well, the Cairo match, uh, it's uh, the Cairo Stadium. It's the biggest stadium in Egypt. It's close. Uh, the situation is unfolding. There's a fire ongoing there. Uh, the total of uh, people injured or killed in that match is not specifically information that I have right now, but uh, we'll definitely be coming to you with more uh, information in the next uh, bulletin. But that was a, a similar picture to what we're seeing right now, as in uh, fans storming the pitch? Yes, sir. It's, it's similar, but not to that extent. Uh, what, what I'm seeing and hearing is a fire in the yeah. background, but I do have little information. But yes, there is some sort of... Uh, Știrile cele mai tari din Maramureș Reale, șocante și necenzurate Știrile care te vor marca zi de zi Știrile pe care le afli mereu primul Actualmeme.ro Mereu primul